What's different about Hurricane Aaron? This hurricane set records when it grew from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in just one day. The windstorm seriously exploded into a Category 5 in about 25 hours over the weekend, luckily before setting into a still strong Category 4 hurricane. This major windstorm hasn't even struck land yet and is already generating 25-foot waves and life-threatening currents along the Atlantic coast. Evacuations are underway on the Outer Banks, Hatteras and Ocracoke are getting warnings while the Bahamas and Turks and Caicos are already feeling the squeeze. Typically, storms this powerful don't start forming until later in hurricane season, in September. You should take note that this one formed in the middle of August. Even though forecasters don't believe Hurricane Aaron will make a U.S. landfall, her power and size will cause plenty of havoc along the East Coast. And yes, warmer waters generate more tropical storms. Not a good sign for climate change. Take a look at our video on the possibility of Category 6 hurricanes forming in the future.